Today I'm going to take you through how I train my competition form. I've got a competition coming up in a couple of weeks, so I'm going to do what I call a dress rehearsal. I'm going to put on my uniform, belt, and everything and do my form just as I would on competition day. I think it's really important to know and figure out how it's going to feel that day as best you can. So try not to always train in, say, like sweatpants and a t-shirt leading up to a competition. I try to put on my uniform and belt at least a couple weeks out just to make sure I've got that feel. So I come here, I do my intro, just like I would in a competition. Some circuits and some different competitions have different things. You might not need an intro, but I do. So it's kind of like an introduction to the judges, tell them my name, what form I'm doing, stuff like that. So I do that pretty much like to myself in the mirror. I do my bow in and everything like that. And then I do my full form once. And then I've broken my form up into three different parts. And I do each section 10 times. And then if there's any problem areas within those sections, I'll go focus on it for a little while. And then to end it, I will do my full form three times. So I do it three times to make sure that I have stamina, make sure that I'm consistent with it. Uh, sometimes you will tie with somebody and you have to do it again right after you've done it. Sometimes you're in a circuit that requires you to do your form a couple of times in a row. So make sure that you can do it and make sure that it looks, your third time looks just as good as your first time. So follow along with me, this is how I train my competition form.
so I just finished up with my training. Now I'm gonna do some stretching and then I'm gonna call it a night. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for a new video every week. Also, you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter, and those links are in the description box below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.